previously on Shadows of Corruption. I need to find where Ponyville is, but I need a disguise if I want to make some friends. Oh my gosh, you're new here! I feel like I know her from somewhere. I'll introduce you to the group. So, Hersey, do you have a place to stay? I hope you find this comfortable. It's, it's only a matter, matter of time, time Hersey. <laughs> Well, I can't bring you Heartsy, because she's gone. Where has she gone? I know the perfect plan to get back at those betrayers. Find Heartsy no matter what the cost. Shaky's gonna do it again. Once a week, we try to teach him to fly. Yes, you're doing it. Wow, this is amazing. Oh, Peacock over here has a not-so-secret crush on cheese sandwich. It's time to spend some time with me now, Heartsy. My friends are really supportive. I love them all dearly. They accepted us straight away for who we were. But it wasn't always like that. We still get teased, even today. Well, I know what you're going through. I was an outcast too. I ran away and came here to Ponyville to start a new life. Now I feel like I finally belong somewhere. Casual dirt marshmallow has arrived. Woo! We're finally here! We're at the go! Peacock, no word of volume, you beeping bird, or I will turn you into KFB. Fine, whatever. It was very generous of Miss Rarity to make these suits and dresses for us. Yeah, they look amazing. Greetings, my friends. Welcome to the gala. I'm so glad you can make it tonight. You all look wonderful. Good evening, princesses. I hope you're pleasant ride on the train here from Ponyville. I heard that there was some commotion in Cantalot Station. I hope everything was sorted out. It was fine, Princess Luna. We're all safe and sound. Good to hear. It's so nice to see other ponies from Ponyville. May I ask what happened at the train station? Peacock held up the train to help a flock of bush stone crows cross the tracks. Of course, it also didn't help that he's out there taking the pictures of the two little fins. They were going to get run over! They are my children and I gave birth to them! Right. Apologies for the delay, princesses. <laughs> it's quite alright. I remember when Tia and I were fiddies. We used to sneak out of Kenlock train tracks all the time after dessert. Tia thought there were jewels underneath them. One time, she ended up in the hospital after trying to lift the trucks. Luna, I told you to never tell any pony that. Seems we didn't find anything there. chance to get you a wedding gift. Uh, I just moved to a new town and things got crazy. No need. Weddings are about more than gifts after all. Weddings are about the love that keeps us together no matter what. Thank you, Princess Cadence, Prince Shining Harmor. 
No. Thank you for coming tonight. It's so nice to see boys from all of Equestria join together for this wonderful celebration. Cadence is right. Now, go enjoy the party. Be sure to mingle with the other guests and try some of the delicious cake. The cake is always one of the best parts, if you ask me. <sighs> of course, sister. <laughs> <laughs> Now, Heartsy, are you ready to party? You know what? Yeah, let's go have some fun. Now we're talking. Woo! Donuts. This is delicious. I have never tasted food like this. It's better than feeding on love. <laughs> What's going on? Why am I feeling this way? Why am I blushing? This is very unusual behavior for a changeling. Peacock, what are you talking about? I don't speak derp. What? Heartsy, do you have a crush on that pony? Oh my gosh, you do! What are you waiting for? Talk to him! Peacock, calm down! I'm not gonna go talk to him. He seems busy. Talk to him now! What? Oh, well, Peacock, what are you doing? You know what they say. Love is full of surprises. Uh, hi. Um... The food here is lovely. The food here is wonderful. The chefs here are said to be the best in Equestria. Only a slight exaggeration, in my estimation. I'm guessing that the princess has hired the chefs from all over Equestria. You're new here, correct? I feel certain I remember seeing such a lovely man before. What's your name, miss? Um, uh, uh, Harsey. My name is Harsey. Harsey. A beautiful name for a beautiful mare. Uh, thank you, Mr. Orion. Serious Orion. Pleased to make your acquaintance, Miss Harsey. Is so weird. A toast to Princess Cadence and Prince Shining Armor. <laughs> A toast. Move it or lose it. We need to keep an eye on these new ponies. Gather as much information as we can. We're going to need it. Yes, Abel. Good evening, every pony, and welcome to the gala in celebration of Princess Cadence and Prince Shining Armor. We are all so happy that ponies from all over Equestria came tonight for this remarkable celebration. This is not just a celebration for them, this is also to celebrate the defeat of Queen Chrysalis and the power that true love and friendship can bring. My most faithful student, Twilight Sparkle, alongside her friends, are proof of that. Now, may I present a very special pony to the stage for a special performance. Melody Snowflake. Thank you, Princess Celestia. It is a great honor to be performing for the new royal couple in Equestria. Tonight, I would like to perform a song that was specially made for this occasion. Now, I would like every pony to grab their sweethearts and make your way onto the dance floor. Sis, 
where have you been this whole time? We've been looking all over for you. Sorry, Snowflake. My friends and I only recently got here due to a mishap on the train. Oi, mind your manners, you beeping bird. <laughs> we wanted to find you to let you know we're heading home. Between me and you, your sister can get pretty grouchy when she's tired. Hey! Alright, I'll come home after a while. See you later. Oh! I'm sorry. I didn't see you, sir. Hi, Peacock. What a surprise to see you here! Cheese sandwich? What are you doing here? I thought you were traveling across Equestria throwing parties. <laughs> I am! My cheesy sense told me that a big celebration would be held here in Cadillac, and I just had to check it out. You know me, my life is one great big dance party! <laughs> well, it's wonderful to see you again. Same here. I've missed you, Peacock. I really have. I've missed you too, Cheesy Toast. Cheesy Toast? Oh, are you giving me nicknames now? I don't know. What if I am? <laughs> Anyways, you look amazing. It's been a while since I've seen you and your friends for that matter. How are they? Thank you, Cheese. And my friends are doing well. Speaking of friends, I met my new friend Heartsy Artsy a week ago. Heartsy? She's that Pegasus mare over there talking to that stallion, I'm guessing. I know a lot of ponies, but I have never seen her in Ponyville before. Or anywhere else, for that matter. Really? You haven't seen her around before? You've been to Cloudsdale, right? I have been to Cloudsdale and know all the ponies there. But I've never seen her there. She looks nervous. I guess she does look a little nervous. For the past week, she's been acting all shifty. She's wanted to be alone for a couple of days, she's rarely eaten anything, and she hasn't been sleeping well. I hope she's okay. I'm really worried about her. She's my friend. I understand what you're saying, Peacock. You can talk to Hatsi later, no need to worry about that now. Parties are all about fun! May I have this polka? I guess you're right. You didn't have to ask me twice! Miss Hartsey, may I have the pleasure of this dance? Um, okay. If you could begin to see just how much you mean to me If I could only count all the ways that you have a hold on my heart When I see your smiling face, I feel like i found my place If you could just understand, you inspire me how to love, it's true It's true All of my past Now it is gone When I look in your eyes All these doubts Fade away Now I start to realize I never knew Any of this It felt so far away But now You make me feel If I could begin to vow Something to make up for how Lonely I used to be I would even learn how to love Now I just need you to see Just how different things will be I would do about anything Just to be able to love like you I know you love me too
feeling a bit under the weather, my dear? I'm fine. I must just be tired. It's been a long day. Perhaps it is time to retire. My place is nearby. If you like, we can get to know another a lot better. Thank you, but I should really catch up with my friends. Please. If you change your mind, I'll be around. Farewell, Miss Hartsey. I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. Thanks, Orion, and thank you for spending the evening with me. <laughs> I'll be right back. I need to go help Hartsey. She's having a relationship crisis. All right, rain check. I'll be over by the food table. Boneless one snack. Isn't that right, Boneless? <laughs> See you in a bit, Cheesy. Save a dance for me, okay? Yeah, I will. She kissed me! She actually kissed me! Woohoo! Did you see that, Bolus? Come on, let's get you some fresh air. It looks like you've seen a changeling. Ugh. <laughs> You mean my mother? She's over there by the fondue station, you beep. I thought Chrysalis was our mother. Wait, we're related? Abel doesn't have any other kids. I am so confused right now. Whatever. Tell your mother that we have found Heartsea. Just stay low and move quietly. We have only a bit of time before she cracks. Hmm, interesting. What's so interesting? Why aren't you out there having fun like the others? What? Oh, uh, I don't find all that hopping around particularly fun. I promised I'd be here though, so I thought I'd make the most of it. We seem to sparkle around anywhere. I'd like a second opinion on something. Uh, why does everyone hold her in such high regard? I do feel your pain. The attention she get does seem disproportionate, but to be fair, she and her friends have saved Equestria a few times. Like the other day at the Cadenza armor wedding with the change. Ah, uh, yes, I know. Every pony is talking about it, okay? Ugh. You know, I think I'm done talking to you. You're just like all these other ponies. I have other business to attend to. These freaking ponies are swimming out there. Hmm. Uh, good news, but bad timing. But I don't have these things fully calibrated yet. I'll need proof. This has been the best night ever. I know, right? We should go out to more parties. Tonight has been amazing. You ponies are the best. I say, has anyone seen Peacock? Um, Peacock? Are you okay? I laced out loud, I won't say I'm in love. Ow! Peacock! That hurts! You better apologize to me! Or you will feel the wrath of the Starburst Princess! Sorry, Star. No, 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 no. This can't happen. Not now. Not now. Party? Yeah. Ah! A changeling! Ooh, it's disgusting. No horror! No horror! Don't be alive! Can't believe it. wait! Come back! We have to go after her! She couldn't have gone far. Right. Come on, every pony. Professor, you coming? Go on ahead. I've got an idea. Miss Celestia, Luna, Miss Cadenza, I've got some information for you. What is it, Professor?
We can't find her. We looked everywhere. I don't understand. Was she pretending to be our friend? Maybe. We're changing still love, so maybe she was stealing from all of us. True. Hearty just pretended to be our friend. I think we should hunt her down before she can steal more love. <sighs> I don't know about any of that, Star. We should all get some sleep before making any rash decisions. It's been a big night for all of us. What? But Heartseed is still out there, maybe in trouble. Juggles is right. We're all too tired. Even my camera can't find her. We won't do any pony any good if we get ourselves lost. We should sort this out in the morning. Hey guys. Has anyone seen Peacock? She better not crash through the wall of my house. Again. did you expect? Well, I wasn't expecting any pony, really. It's nice to see you again. Save it. Yeah, we know what you really are now. Did you really expect your stupid plan to work? You must have been an idiot to think it would. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I just wanted friends. I didn't mean to hurt you or your feelings. I was afraid that if any pony knew I was a changeling, they wouldn't want to be friends with me. <laughs> well, you were right about one thing. Yeah, who would ever want to be friends with a changeling? Yeah, certainly not me. Me neither. Fine, I never should have left the hive. I'm better off alone than with friends like you. Yes, is always so easily fooled. Well done, all around. The Queen will be most pleased with what we've accomplished here tonight. The first part of the plan is successful. Now, let's go back to the Hive. Crystallis will surely need our help when she returns. Yes, Adele. Yes, Mother. <laughs> Marie, what did I say about calling you that in public? Sorry, Mum. What a day. I just found out that Heartsy is a changeling. And I don't know why or how or why would she become our friend. I mean, she's a changeling. Changelings eat love. Well, I don't know anymore. All I wanted was for tonight to be nice and calm without any drama. And now, there is drama. <sighs> I think I am overreacting a bit. I need some sleep. Hopefully, things will turn around in the morning. Uh, who goes there? I have my sister who gets triggered by deer and a velociraptor mother, and I'm not afraid to use them. You silly, silly pony. Don't you recognize the Queen of Changelings? No, no! You can't be real! This has to be a nightmare! <laughs> Your worst nightmare, in fact. I am very real, my dear. I have come to deliver a message to you. I know that Heartsy is here with you and your friends. I also know that she let her little disguise slip ever so carelessly. What a shock that must have been to you. Well... Yeah. It was quite shocking. I still can't believe that she's a changeling. I really thought she was a pony. That's the thing, my dear. Heartsy was tricking you! Using you for her hunger! Um. <sighs> Think about it! Remember all those times when she was unsure about the activities you and your friends do together? Remember the times when she would be left alone? 
How she never quite fit in with your group of friends. Yeah, I do remember the times where she did all that. But maybe she did it for a reason. Maybe she did all those things to protect us from knowing her true self. What you say might be true, but I don't think that she wanted to hurt any pony. Maybe she did all those things to protect us from knowing because... Maybe she wanted friends? Friends? <laughs> Please. I've known her ever since she was a little larva. She may not show it, but she is every bit of evil as I am. Surely you must have seen the signs. My drones took note of your friends, you know. You are more skeptical than you let on. And soon, every pony will know who Artsy truly is. You've been spying on us? What are you talking about? Don't you understand? You and your pathetic friends fell right into my trap. You were all too blind to see it. I guess I really shouldn't be surprised, however. Ponies can usually only see the light, never concerning themselves with the darkness that lurks just around the corner. Clouds are white and then they turn gray. The moon can shine bright as the sun, don't you see? The precious princess of night succumb to the powers of fright. Now tell me, how can you expect to be free? Don't you know that dark clouds can cause rain? Sunrise is just as pretty as sunset. And for those who turn astray, Forgiveness is shown right away! If only you listened, then maybe one day... You will never be right, evil will find her! You will never be right, you're always wrong! Revenge will be sweet when this plan is complete! You will never be right, she'll be gone! You are so blinded by darkness around you. You should really use some perfume for your smell. I fear you won't find your place. Oh, your actions are quite the disgrace. Turn around, my words are sound, can't you tell? You will never be right, you little weakling. You will never be right, I'll reign supreme. Soon she will feel that her nightmares are real. By the time that I'm through, she'll be gone. You will never be right, evil will find her. You will never be right, light shines through. My dear, here's a sign. You're at the end of your line. You will never be right. You will never be right. My dear, rise for your queen, let the darkness shine. Power shall be mine before you know it. You will never be right, you will never be right. I will always be right, heart sees down. You just can't bring yourself to say that I'm right. Now everything is working perfectly. My plan is halfway complete. All I need now is you. What? Guards, take this pony back to the hive and keep out of sight. We don't want any point to find out what happened here. Yes, Your Majesty! What? No! What have you done with my family, Chrysalis? Where are they? You won't get away with this! Foolish pony, can't you see? I already have. 